what's up my beautiful butterflies it's your girl sadie's 912 back at y'all again so coming at y'all real quick um gonna be making my rice water for sunday that'll be my last one for the four week update so on sunday i will give you all my honest review on the rice water so i'm gonna just show y'all how i make mine Nothing special, just using my basmati rice, um, the mason jar, water out the sink, and um, some vitamin E oil, peppermint oil, and rosemary oil. Um, usually I use my cup, my little measuring cup, so I guess I'll do that today. The last time I did it, last week, I didn't measure at all. I just kind of eyeballed it. But mine is a three-fourths cup. And I just put two of these in. And then I fill, fill, the, uh, fill the water up all the way. keep mine in my bathroom because I'm not using that one for my kitchen and this one is specifically for my rice water and when I put the water in there I use the end of this to swish it around I've seen somebody's video um, oh. I seen a video where somebody was saying that um, you shouldn't necessarily put your hand in it. So something about the take some of the nutrients or something out of it or whatever. So I switch this around in there. So that if it is anything in there, it'll come to the top. Like with my first one, um, it was like little bugs in it. That I had found. Um, after that, I, I think the second time I found some too, but the third time I didn't find anything. And it looks like this, and I'm about to dump this out. it off a couple of more times but because I don't see anything floating in it I'm gonna just do the two like I did the last time I did this and then add the um, add my uh, oils to it water and oils and let it go ahead and ferment how it looks and my vitamin e oil has 70,000 I use in it um, so it is a strong vitamin e oil where's my rosemary <laughs> I don't have that much I actually got to go out and get some more rosemary and uh I have two bottles of peppermint, so I'm going to just put like one, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five, six. 
and it helps the smell. I mean, honestly, the smell doesn't bother me as much as it does some people's videos I watch. Like, some of them, I think y'all <laughs> going a little overboard on the smell. And I haven't always added the, um, the uh, oil to it, both oils. So, I think the first time, I don't remember if I added anything the first time. I know the second time I did which was vitamin E and peppermint. And then the third time for sure I did peppermint and rosemary because it really smells good. Um, so this is what it's gonna look like. And I just leave it in my bathroom. And then on Sunday, I will um, do a video of me using it. I'll do a video on Sunday of me using it. Um, as best as I can anyways um and then come back at y'all with um if there's been any growth or anything like that and anything else that I have seen from the rice water um but I can tell you right now that it is something that I will use in the future but I normally do not wash my hair every week. Um, I'm more so a two to three week type of person who washes their hair. So a weekly, not going to happen. Because um, I try to do like a hot oil treatment every two to three weeks. So I will be incorporating rice water for the future into my regimen um, probably for after I do my oil treatments, I'll probably do the rice water. Um, but, yeah. So, y'all stay tuned. Don't forget, rate, comment, and subscribe. Deuces.